Deck two, box one, worlds collide. Let's get it. Come on, eighty. You know, come on, ninety. Let's get, let's eat greedy. Eat real greedy. Right, the Countess of Doom Lane, Brobnar, Star Alliance, and Untamed. What are the rares? We'll see them when we see them. If any decks are getting saved in the plastic, you know that's going to be the key for us, decks. Right? Ah, ripped it a little bit. The Archon. Cool. Alright. Pose Pixies. One drop, elusive. I mean, one, one strength, elusive. Uh, amber stolen or captured from your pool is taken from the common supply instead. Okay, you're not very sticky, but when you do stick, that's cool. King of Fent. Five drop. Used to hate this guy. Five strength. Used to hate this guy. But you, but you just reap with them when you're ready to get rid of them. But uh, each creature gains reap. Destroy this creature. Uh, grasping vines. One pip on there. Return up to three artifacts to their owner's hands. Unsuspecting prey. Play deal two damage to up to three undamaged creatures. The fittest. One pip. Give each friendly creature plus one power counter. Rust knower. Four strength fight destroying artifact. If that artifact had an amber bonus, you gain that much amber. Three Rusnars. Man, I opened this as soon as I just played the four artifacts minimum Keyforge Knight last week. Alright, putting these to the side and see how many artifacts are in this deck to see if that would have been eligible. Alright, uh Mustic Murmook for power. Each player's keys cost plus one amber and play deal four damage to a creature. Harmonia, elusive after you play a creature. If there are more enemy creatures than friendly creatures, gain one amber. Two of those. Ghost Hawk, deploy. You may reap with each neighboring creature one at a time. This looks like a good Harmonia deck because I do have a bunch of creatures in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight out of twelve. That can't ask for more than that not too much all right on to the star alliance i would say that's pretty pretty solid untamed okay we got united action action don't recall ever seeing this one and it's a rare of course alpha for the remainder play effect for the remainder of the turn you may play cards from any house from which you have a card in play oh yeah just wait till you have a three three house board and then go ham on this turn and you can't use cards this turn. You can't use cards this turn. Okay, you can play them, but you can't use them. And it has alpha. So you can dump your hand if you have... Dump your hand, but you can't use cards, though. Yeah, this one is strange, but United Action. Set up a good board. Hope it doesn't get wiped. All right, Universal Trends later the first artifact no this is actually an upgrade uh it's got a pip on it this creature gains fight reap use a friendly non-star alliance creature okay oh yeah house cheating love that i mean it's not a rare but i pretty much want to put it here yeah you know what for the sake of i'm gonna put that there you well let me put it over here all right then we got quadra quarter your opponent's keys cost plus one amber for each house represented among friendly creatures to a maximum of three. All right. Opponent's stuff costs plus three if you have all your houses out. Cool. Nurse Soto. Male nurse. Cool. Uh, human deploy and play fight reap. Heal three damage from each of Nurse Soto's neighbors. Cal one in 
Two power, one armor, fight, reap, draw a card. And Calv went in, may be played as an upgrade instead of a creature. With the text, this creature gains fight, reap, draw a card. Can't lose with this guy. And the upgrade would give you, yeah, just the text, fight, reap, draw one. I'd probably rather play him as a creature, but, I mean, if you just want to draw a card or something. Eh. Like that guy. Red alert. Play, if there are more, more enemy creatures than friendly creatures, deal damage to each enemy creature equal to the difference. Right? I don't have many Star Alliance decks. So, uh, Light of the Archons, one pip. Uh, uh, upgrade this creature gets plus one power and armor for for each upgrade attached to it. Two of those. And Explore Rover, three powers. Skirmish. Explore Rover may be played as an upgrade instead of a creature with the text. This creature gains Skirmish. Chief Engineer Walls, elusive. And Play Fight Reap. You may return and upgrade a robot card from your discard pile to your hand. Two of those. Upgrade or robot. Yeah, count them robots. Arms Master Molina, Hazardous, three. And each of Arms Master's Molina's neighbors gains Hazardous, three. On to the Brobnar. This is one of those, what, legacy cards? All right, this one's got the pip on it. And Mog, Hogger, Mog Hunter's Brew, action, give a creature two plus one counters. One pip on there. And another legacy card, maybe. Uh, Mega Mog Hunter, 8 drop. I mean, 8 power. And a fight, deal 2 damage to a flank creature. See, solid. And the flex. Choose a... Not sure about these ones, but... Uh, the, the the flex play, choose a ready, friendly Brobnar creature. Exhaust it and gain amber equal to half its power, rounding down the game. And a uh, Shattered Throne, 1 pip. This may be the first artifact, matter of fact, so probably wouldn't have qualified on this deck. But, uh, one pip. After a creature is used to fight, it captures one amber. Opogago. Ogopogo. Ogopogo. Six power. After Ogopogo attacks and destroys a creature, you may deal two damage to a creature. Flame, Wake, Shaman. Four power. Play, deal two damage to a creature. Human. Instead of a giant. Uh, flamethrower. Action deal one damage to a creature with one splash. Second artifact. Uh, warrior's refrain. One pip. Play. Stun each creature with power three or lower. That seems pretty excellent. Yeah, I mean, this is great against shadows right here. And a uh, Narp. Eight power. Narp's neighbors can't reap. One armor. Calfine five before fight deal two damage to each neighbor of the creature Calfine fights. Volcano play deal four damage to a creature, gain two chains. Alaka four power giant. If you have used a creature to fight this turn, Alaka enters play ready. All right, not enough pips in this deck, but man, a quick guess. I'm probably get this a. You got the house cheating. Not too much house cheating, though. I'm going to get this a 69. We do have... We came out strong at the gate with the... With the untamed. And let's count the robots. Human, human, human. One robot. Two robots. Yeah, you don't even have enough robots to pop that off. But upgrades, how many upgrades? One possible, two, three, four possible. Four upgrades, two robots, I think. Half the cards in there. But, um, yeah, let me go with the 69. We'll see what this is. BRB. Wiggity want, 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 want. 56 gave away too much credit. 56 got a 48 base arc plus 10 synergy minus 3 anti synergy plus 1 meta 56 in the top 13 percent of 56 savage decks it looks like and I gave it far too much credit but that happens sometimes all right
stay tuned for the next Worlds Collide. Or by the time this comes out, actually, it'll probably be the next Winds of Exchange deck. All your games, like, comment, subscribe, and peace.